Good day everyone. Thanks for watching this educational video about grease selection for tapered roller bearings. I am Besha Saba, Senior Technical Advisor of Holly Frontier Specialty Lubricants in Ontario, Canada. Every tapered roller bearings have common components such as cone, which we identify its diameter by bore, cup, which we identify its diameter by outside diameter, the thickness or width, cage or separator, and rolls. Grease has three components, base oils, thickeners, and additives like extreme pressure, EP additives. Base oils are typically mineral or synthetic. Thickeners can be different type of metal soaps or non-soaps such as polyurea and clay. For roller bearing application, the majority of the time lithium or lithium complex thickeners are recommended. Additives are selected based on the application and operation of the grease. You can learn more about the grease in another recorded webinar. To choose the right base oil viscosity for the bearing, we need to calculate the speed factor or NDM. NDM is the mean diameter of the bearing in millimeter times the speed in RPM. The mean diameter of the bearing is the outside diameter plus inside diameter divided by two. A low NDM means the bearing is rotating slowly. If the NDM is around 50,000, the base oil viscosity required for the grease is between 1,000 to 1,500 centistoke at 40 Celsius. On the contrary, if the NDM is around million, the base oil viscosity required for this grease is between 15 to 32 centistoke at 40 Celsius. It means that the bearing is rotating very fast. So using these calculations will help us choose the correct base oil viscosity for the bearing application. Hertzian pressure or stress. When two bodies having Grease Timken OK Load ASTM D2509. In a tapered roller bearing, we have the line contact, which means the surface of the rollers will be in contact with the outer layer of the cone. This is considered as a Hertzian pressure and stress at the contact line. Timken OK Load test equipment is designed to simulate exact industrial application inside the tribology lab for tapered, needle, spherical, and cylindrical roller bearings. In this test, we have a steel test block and a rotating cup or cylinder. The rotating speed is 123 meter per minute. Grease will be injected to the contact line of cylinder and block at 24 to 30 Celsius. Little by little, we increase the force and on a specific interval, we check the test block showing various types of scar. When the wear and scar evidence at any load stage makes the definition of the onset of a scoring questionable, we will repeat the test at the same load and if the same score presents itself, we will report the load and scar. Next time, when you want to choose a grease for your tapered bearing, you can look at the speed factor or NDM of your bearing based on the bearing design and geometry and rotation speed. This will help you to find the right base oil viscosity for your grease. Then you will compare the two greases and the one with the higher Timken OK load test result will be the better choice. Thank you for watching this educational video on grease selection for tapered roller bearings. If you require more information, please contact me using my contact details. Thank you and have a great day.